so from where should I go now? I, sh I think I'll go straight. All right. Um, there is a female driver behind me, and she is driving a Hyundai car. And you know, I'm scared of uh, very less, very little things in life. And one of the things which I'm scared about is riding next to a girl who is driving her car or a girl who is riding a bike. This, this, that, these two things are like one of the scariest things I have ever experienced in my life because uh, the truth is the truth, man. Come on. Girls have some altered sense of judgment or some sense of overconfidence which I can't really explain it to you but I'm sure as a guy you must have experienced it in your life many times. And I, I am from one have experienced that like multiple number of times and uh, it's really scary and you cannot argue with them, you cannot say anything with them and uh, you just cannot uh, ask anyone else for help because of a female who is troubling you on the road because what happens is most of uh, the people they take the side of the female or the woman who is uh, driving and uh, most importantly uh, the thing is that what the hell was that? Okay, anyways, uh, so most importantly, the thing is that women, women have this r really unique talent of like uh, crying uh, at a drop of a hat. They can cry almost any instant, like uh, just, you just have to tell them, cry, and they start crying. And for a guy, it's, it's like one of the most difficult things uh, to, by the way, this is a GSB uh, Ganesh Utsav Vadala Samiti. And one of the most richest Ganpati uh, Mandals over here. So, uh, what I was talking about, yeah, so it's very easy for a woman to cry and uh, and basically, so that really <laughs> changes the entire situation. And obviously, no one will trust a guy in that matter. Tune rulaya, tune rulaya isko, ye wo, sab aise sab hota hai and so all these things are even applicable on the road. Traffic police, they give them leniency, they show leniency towards women. So, what are you doing? If you are a girl, you will be able to do it. It's a good thing. This is one of the most irritating things about Mumbai. You can see that yesterday it was not dug up. It wasn't. But today it's like, what is happening? It's not going to be a good thing. It's not going to be this is one of the most irritating things about Mumbai. Just when I was thinking, wow, what a beautiful place this is. The lovely South Indian hotels and uh, you know the options you get. And the only worst part is of Mumbai is of parking and uh, uh, really bad roads, unpredictable roads. I, you know, even though you may have the money to buy a car or a bike. But you have to think twice before buying the car of your choice because you cannot like buy an expensive item over here and ride it without getting a huge bill on your next servicing because uh, the suspension takes a huge beating on these roads and plus it's not fun just not fun to ride in the city the car moves at a snail pace it's only when you move on the outskirts of the city that you get a chance so most of the people they get time in the evenings or on holidays on weekends but those are the times when Mumbai is jam-packed the roads are jam-packed and uh, it's like half your time goes in traffic half your time goes on uh, you're waiting you're waiting at signals half your time goes in arguing with traffic cops so it's that kind of thing <laughs> by the way i hope my bike has enough fuel in it because i have been riding for quite some time now 